Hey everybody, it's Matt from Union Horror Movies, and welcome to day 25 of my 31 days of horror. Uh, again, a review a day for 31 days. Whew, now we're at 25, almost done. Yes, wow, so far it's been a challenge, but I'm working on it. So, without further ado, I'm bringing you a film from 1966. Uh, Scream Factory put this Blu-ray out, but also I had the original put out by OEG Classic Movies. Yes, you're like, huh? It is a multi-region movie, A, B, and C on Blu-ray. Uh, they put out a couple other classic uh, films. But I think this is an Amicus film, and they put this out. I did not get the Scream Factory one. I have the OEG, I just didn't bother. It's the same version, and that's called The Island of Terror. Yes, Island of Terror. On this small little island called Petrie Island, there's a weird disease going around. Uh, the townsfolk happens to call in Peter Cushing and uh, Edward Judd. They're coming to investigate these weird uh, series of uh, deaths or diseases. Well, come to find out, it's not a disease. What it is, is back before, a bunch of scientists were working in this underground lab with different types of organisms. Well, of course, there's an accident in the lab, and due to radiation exposure, these organisms have grown really huge about the size of maybe of a kid's bike that's how big we're looking at well these organisms are known as silicates uh they are organisms that devour bone only they don't uh drink anything else off or anything just leave a like a rubber glove behind so you know if you take off a rubber glove throw it on the ground that's your body's gonna look like after these silicates are done with you well, of course, Peter Cushing and them are trying to investigate what's going on, and of course, they come across these gigantic creatures. And of course, um, they're finding other bodies of rubber dead bodies on the ground. And of course, they're trying to destroy these so-called creatures. They're very hard to kill, very indestructible. They have a very uh, big shell on them. Um, they look really weird, but they look pretty badass. As you can see, glare, that's what they look like. Just this weird, roundish, tentacled monster. I love it. <clears throat> and of course, uh, now it's up to the townsfolk to survive the to survive and destroy these things because they're growing at an at an extremely rate. They're populating so fast. They're fucking like rabbits. They're everywhere. So of course, the island is being covered and destroying anything living in its path, animals and people. It's actually a very well done for a film from 1966. Uh, this Blu-ray has an original trailer, image gallery, and it's got an extensive booklet notes, which is inside the, the blue itself. It comes with this cool uh, book. So I don't think the Screen Factory Edition has that, but this OEG is, again, region free. So you can play it in any region if you want. And uh, as you can see, there's A, B, and C in the corner there. But the picture quality is fantastic. I don't know what the Screen Factory version looks like. I just know they're both uncut. There is, a, I think, a DVD or a VHS out there that's cut, meaning there is an arm amputee scene that's not shown. But it is shown on the Blu-ray of this one, and it's shown on the Screen Factory that I am aware of. But other than that, the acting superb. Uh, Peter Cushing does a fantastic job in this movie. Uh... Definitely recommend it. If you find it, get the Screen Factory Edition. Or, again, if you just want to have the film, grab this edition as well. Or just grab it alone on this one. I like this edition. I never bothered upgrading. Everything was fine with me. Uh, there was no issues with the copy, with uh, transfer picture quality or anything like that. This Blu-ray was well done. So, guys, thanks very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my uh, Day 25. So, oh, yeah, rating. I would probably give this an 8.5 out of 10 for an old film, cool creature effects, all, you know, of course it's practical during that time. <laughs> There's nothing CGI at all. Awesome flick, guys. Definitely checking out Island of Terror from 1966. Great little flick, guys. I hope you enjoyed my review. Let me know in the comments down below your thoughts. If you have the Screen Factory edition or you have this edition, let me know. Peace.